Hi, I'm Liam from Fowles and welcome to the Home Renovators Auction Preview for Wednesday the 25th of November at 10am. Well, have a look at this beautiful day bed. Uh, you'd be looking, I reckon, between $1,000 and $1,200 in the shops. Uh, I'll get the bidding going tomorrow somewhere in the high fours, early fives, and I imagine it'll bid up to that uh, mid five to $600 mark. Really beautiful, really comfortable, and I'm sure it'll be great in your backyard. Plenty of other bits and pieces. We've got heaps of outdoor furniture tomorrow. There's another one there. It's a double recliner. That's pretty cool. Uh, also, uh, tomorrow Tomorrow I think there's three kitchens in going under the hammer so probably your last opportunity this year to uh, to get into one of the auction kitchens really fantastic um, and I imagine look it's hard to say probably between the, the mid twos uh, and the and the low fours just depending on the configuration uh, that you're bidding on uh, swinging around now have a quick look at all these beautiful cooking packages uh, we've got uh, oven and cooktop combinations we've got oven by themselves cooktop by themselves heaps of range hoods there uh, and they will all be unbeatable money tomorrow. You will not find uh, better value anywhere uh, than that auction tomorrow. That will be sensational. All with two year warranty as well so uh, you can bid with confidence uh, and get yourself an absolute bargain. Uh, moving down through now I can see heaps of mattresses over to the right hand side. Beautiful double pillow top mattresses. So on one side you've got uh, memory foam. On the other side a latex pillow top. So there's the two pillow tops there. Really nice big thick mattresses. Queen size, king size double and single I think are the main ones we've got at the moment. Uh, really nice buying on those ones. Uh, moving across on the other side now, plenty of splashbacks, heaps of different colours uh, in that 300 by 600 size. Uh, and you can look at you look at around 100 bucks for five of them is generally the uh, the bidding on those. And there is toughened glass and non-toughened glass. Uh, more appliances here. I can see beautiful stainless steel uh, front dishwashers there. I think two years warranty on those as well. Uh, these could be a good gift for someone. The high pressure cleaners. Uh, uh, looks like there's about maybe two dozen of those going out. Um, high 60s, early $70 mark, so good little buy there. Over on the other side now, plenty of lighting, heaps of down lights, pendants, LED globes, all to clear. Really nice. That's been super popular the last few weeks. Moving down a bit further now, uh, we've got plenty of homewares as well. We've got kids' toys, uh, beautiful homewares there, plenty of um, nice little gift plates here. Uh, I can see, what's that there? A photo key ring, so you get all sorts of things in the home renovator. Uh, down in the bottom there, I can see plenty of uh, generators there. They're 800 watts. Uh, last week, bid to 230. Uh, so I reckon that'll be about the money again. So don't pay 500 bucks in the shops. If you need a nice little uh, four-stroke generator, uh, that could be absolutely perfect for you. Heaps of mirrors there as well. Generally looking between sort of 20 and 30 bucks on the mirrors. Uh, stack more homewares moving down a bit further now. Uh, st heaps of these pillows. Uh, these are in the uh, in the homeware stores around $50, sort of 40 to 50 dollars a shot usually. Um, we'll get all those going for $8 a piece tomorrow so they're good buying. Uh, plenty of kids for the toys. Christmas is coming so you could uh, grab yourself a few bargains there and uh, fill the stockings nice and early. I can see milkshake makers, remote control toys, all sorts of bits and pieces there. Uh, down here we've got some taps. Uh, well, these will be to clear now. I reckon uh, we'll get these going around the $30 mark tomorrow. Have a look at that. It's got the, uh, the pull-out veggie spray. Uh, beautiful big chrome design there. Uh, and yeah, you'd probably look in the shops $200. We'll get them going for $30. So it uh, looks like there's a few to go around there. Uh, remote control boats. I can see a little vanity there. A little, um, little ensuite vanity or a little powder room vanity. Down the back here, plenty of gardening tools. I can see cordless pruning saws. I can see hedge trimmers. Uh, more bathroom and kitchen wear up the top here, taps, uh, what else we got, shower heads, bath spouts, all sorts of bits and pieces to clear here. There's a pallet of welding rod there, I think from memory a couple of hundred bucks will probably get the whole pallet moving. Uh, what have we got across the way here, high pressure washers, beautiful petrol powered high pressure washers, oh, Michael's just filming on these baths, these uh, these uh, bath screens or shower panels, uh, from memory about a hundred dollars on those in the safety glass. Uh, and then sp spinning around now we've got the high pressure washers there, a couple of different sizes, made in America, beautiful looking things there. I can see some ceiling fans, good season to put a ceiling fan in, complete with the wall controllers, probably looking mid 30s to about the $40 mark will be the bidding range on those. Moving down now, uh, beautiful microwaves, these are almost gone now, almost finished the the, uh, the wall mounted convection microwave, probably looking about $120 there with a three month warranty, beautiful buying also. Some American made generators, big commercial size generators there, 5.6 kVA, 6. 
1.4 kVA. Really nice looking units there. Uh, looks like there's a pallet of toilet seats here. Uh, looks like a, a pallet of timber toilet seats. I'm presuming that will be unreserved, so that could be good fun for someone. If you've got a toilet seat shop, uh, make sure you're here tomorrow. Uh, you can bid on that and get it for a bargain. Down there we've got the toolbox there. Uh, we've been through quite a few of these. The, the designed to go on the back of your ute, uh, and you're looking around the $400 mark, and I have seen those in the shops for about eight or $900, so really good buying there. Portable evaporative coolers from memory going around that $60 mark. Again, good season for it. Nice little vanities, they've been popular. Again, around the $60 mark, only 400 mil wide, so great for a powder room or a really small ensuite. Across the way here, we've got some Technica stuff, bits and pieces. We've got um, sinks there, dual cooktops, big 900 cooktops, and over on the end here, we've got a beautiful Technica uh, 1200 mil twin range hood. So it's got the two engines there. Really good buying on those ones there at around three, probably 360, 370. Uh, still in the shops at 2,000 bucks. So uh, really good buying there. Uh, moving up the back now, we've got plenty of vanities in tomorrow. If you need a vanity, um, huge amount of vanities. So a lot, everything for the bathroom, shower screens, baths, vanities tomorrow. Fantastic buying there. Uh, moving a bit further forward now, we've got some Italian cookware there. We've got beautiful Techna gas freestanding cookers. Also, we've got some 450 mil uh, dishwashers there, double ovens. Uh, moving down, you can also see these beautiful black Frankie sinks. Also some stainless steel sinks there. Right the way through. Michael will show you through all of those. A uh, little bit of furniture left over from last week too. We just about sold out on the furniture. A couple of cancelled orders though, so uh, you, if you did miss out last week, uh, you'll get you'll pick yourself up a bargain and it all matches up as you can see. There's the table there, uh, there's the coffee table, there's the bedside or the side table. I think there's also, oh here we go, uh, we've got a beautiful media unit as well. I think the media units, they went out under 200, well under 200 I'm pretty sure, but we'll just get them going tomorrow. Uh, whatever we get for them, uh, they'll be gone. That's uh, really, really super buying there. Uh, there's some nice hammocks here, uh, the jumbo hammock. I'll get the jumbo hammock going in the low 200s. I reckon you'll probably be the successful bidder in the sort of mid to high $200 mark there. Uh, there's a, a more simple one there as well, just a, a uh, powder coated tin one there. We'll get that going probably about $50, $40, $50, something like that. Uh, and there's then a heap of shower screens, as I mentioned before, stacks and stacks of shower screens, so there really should be something to fit uh, your bathroom, and I reckon you'll be looking around that $100 to $150 mark on all those, so make sure you check those out uh, on the catalogue. Moving through now to the carpet and uh, floor coverings auction, uh, where you'll almost always save between 50 and 90% off the normal prices. Uh, all different roll sizes, uh, room sizes, house lots, developed lots uh, in wool, nylon, solution dyed nylon. I can see beautiful colours there. I can see browns, beiges, uh, charcoals. Uh, also on the left hand side some carpet tiles. Uh, a lot of those will get going from $5 a square metre. So there's a couple of, at $5 they'll kick off. A couple of kick off around the 10 mark. So really good buying there. Over the back some artificial turf as well. You're probably kicking away around the probably around the $15 a, be, a square metre mark for the artificial turf. Moving into Michael's timber and uh, timber, timber and building materials auction now. Uh, he's got a huge number of lots. How many lots have you got, Michael? Uh, 775. About 775 lots. Huge auction tomorrow uh, in the timber and building materials. Decking, uh, I can see a heap of pallet racking there, flooring, plywood, floating floors, uh, all sorts of bits and pieces. Uh, beautiful Vic Ash flooring there, some tiles. So all in all, three fantastic looking auctions. We look forward to seeing you here tomorrow at 10am. Thanks for watching.